Good morning, everybody. It's Gina. It's October 3rd already. I think my old boyfriend's birthday is tomorrow. Isn't it pitiful that I don't remember that? I mean, I've been married and I've been with my husband for 34 years, so I shouldn't know it. But I feel like his birthday might be tomorrow. Anyways, if so, happy birthday. I know you don't watch me. You don't ever even have anything to do with me. Even though we live in the same town still. Whole story with that. If you don't know, I married my boyfriend's best friend at the time. <laughs> okay. If you're new to the Gina, I'm sorry that that's how you started knowing me. But it's not like we're not together and been together forever. So it is already like, I don't even know what time it is, 10 o'clock. And I haven't vlogged at all yet today. I haven't eaten anything yet today. I've had a cup of coffee and I brought my lunch today, which is, okay. So I brought two of my egg muffins that I meal prepped over the weekend. Um, they are still frozen, but one for today and one for tomorrow. Plenty of breakfast for me. Um, if I need a piece of toast, there's plenty of bread here and I have a toaster somewhere. I don't know exactly where it is, but I have a toaster in here somewhere. Um, off topic, but have a question. Have you ever had an actual, to okay, pet peeve, a little bit of a rant, and have a question. Have you ever had a Tupperware item that doesn't actually close? I mean, I've never had one that, it doesn't matter how many times I close it, it just, I don't know. And it wasn't in the freezer. I just put the frozen ones in this this morning. But I can't get it to stay closed, so I opened the vacuum seal, thinking, okay, maybe that's it. Close it, and, you know, it just, um, it's kind of bent. That's the best way to put that. I mean, a little bit of pressure is going to open this, and that's not normal. And my rant is this is Tupperware. See it say Tupperware? Just because something is plastic does not mean it's Tupperware. Although I watch cleaning videos a lot for motivation. And these kids, because most of them are kids, young 20, 30 year old kids that are doing these videos call everything that is plasticware Tupperware. And I guarantee you it's because their mothers grew up with Tupperware. <laughs> and so they think it's called Tupperware. But it's not. This is not Tupperware. Tupperware is a brand. Okay, I'm ranted. I've ranted. That's enough of that. So there's my breakfast. And my lunch is a frozen again. I had a, um, I made a thing of a um, vegetable, beef, and um, I put in the whole pot a cup of pasta in it. So it's mainly vegetables and beef and broth and um this is a little bit more than a serving because I'm only going to eat a cup for the serving and it's five points for the cup. I think there's two cups in here, so it would be 10 points if I ate the whole thing. Um, but I'm going to eat this today and tomorrow as well. And so I'm doing pretty good as far as meal prep and eating on track. And um, I'm just going to go ahead and tell you right here. I lost another pound in a 0.2, 1.2. A pound yesterday and a 1.2 today, and I'm stoked. I'm, like, thrilled. I don't know if it's the competitive nature in me or it's the fact that all of you are doing so well. I mean, together, I would say we lost our group, all, all three groups. I, I know we're over 40, probably 40, 45 pounds. Maybe I'm exaggerating a bit. Matter of fact, I'll, when I talk to the girls, so sometime during this video, I'll get a total of that. So for the second, we know what everybody's weight was already. Right? For the first. See? Okay, that leads me to this, and we're going to be done talking about the contest, because this is a vlog, not an everyday talk about the contest. Make sure when you're posting your weight, if you're part of the uh, Vlogtober Battle of the Bulge Challenge, that you put the date that you weighed in, and then I'll put it on the spreadsheet for that day. So say you've, uh, you know, I, we have one gal that's um, wanting to play all of our 
channels, but she's out of town right now. Well, she when she gets back, she's going to update us on all of it. And um, so we want to be able to put it in. Now, of course, she won't be able to win that day, but her for the whole, for the week and everything, it'll be there. And um, so I just want to make sure that you know, put the date as well as the amount that you lost or gained, making sure you let us know if it was a loss or a gain in the comments. And um, and if you want to put your weight too, that's fine. That just reiterates with us, you know, kind of where you're at. You don't need to put your weight every day. If you put it on the first day, then we're good, but you can do whatever is comfortable for you. Of the three of us, our challenge, and, and I was just so excited that I was going to win again today. That didn't happen. One of the other girls beat me. You're going to have to go find that out because we're not sharing that part of it. That's why you got to go over there and see. But yeah, yeah. when you find out which one didn't, give a little bit of sympathy. When you find out which one did, razz them because I'm going to. Okay, so I'm here at work. Uh, my plan is to sit at my desk all day long and get work done because I feel like I've just been up and out and doing for so long. Um, I'm just going to sit here and update books, balance checkbooks. I think those two things might fill up my day, but I'm excited about that. And when I know more about who won in our group yesterday, I will let you know. Talk to you in a bit. Okay, so it's 11 o'clock and I still haven't eaten anything and I totally feel my sugar dropping or rising. I don't know, I've had coffee, so basically all I've had today is sugar and caffeine. And um, so I went ahead and heated up both of my egg muffins um, to try to get a little bit of protein. And hopefully that levels me out, I'm not sure. But I just wanted to get on here and say... You people rock! So many people have already been checking in um, on my 10-2 video and giving us your updates and playing on all three channels. And it's just so much fun. I'm so, I, I can't explain how much I'm enjoying this. But um, I really just kind of wanted to talk about this being a vlog today. And I wanted you to know that this is what I do. Like, for instance, I can't see right now. And I realize that it seems like this should be a diabetic thing, but we have, we've all been through this. If you've been following me for any amount of time, you already know. And if you're new, I have been tested and tested and tested. I am not diabetic. However, I am blind in this eye due to weird circumstances. And when I eat sugar, it affects me poorly. And all I've had today is coffee and sugar. That's all I've had. And it's 11 o'clock. And it was like all of a sudden, everything in my whole world changed. And I was like, woo. So I'm going to eat. How are you all doing? Are you tracking while you're doing this? I'm still having trouble tracking, mainly because I'm way under on my points generally. I'm trying today to get to my points. But I know for a fact that when I get too close to my allotted amount of points, I gain weight. And I don't want to do that. Because I don't want Sandy to win. Just don't. Did you see where I made these? I showed it on a video a couple days ago. I meal prepped them and put them all in the freezer. I'm telling you, I was afraid that they were going to be spongy and weird. They taste just like they did the day I made them. Except I have spinach in my teeth. I know I do. I don't think I need the bacon in it. And honestly, I think I would like this with broccoli and hash browns more than I would bacon. What are you guys eating for lunch and dinner today? I'm eating this and we're having tacos for dinner. Okay, I cannot stress enough the importance of eating. Just because we're in this challenge does not give us license to not eat until noon. I already feel so much better. So I think I can go to work now, maybe. Maybe. What the heck was that noise? How many of you heard the noise? Presidential alert. This is a test of the National Wireless Emergency Alert System. Sounded like an Amber Alert. 
which freaks me out every single time. I swear those could give someone a heart attack or cause an accident if you're driving down the road and the Amber Alerts go off. I know we need them. They do wonderful. They have wonderful benefits, but they scare me. Last time I'm really going to get back to work. I just want you to see that it's only 1130 and I added up everybody who weighed in so far for the second. Yeah, I did. And we as a group of people, I couldn't think of the word. I wanted to say con, con something and I couldn't think of any of it. Lost 20 Point one pounds in one day. Yes, we did. So we'll wait to the end of the day to see what I can add to this number. You people rock. Well, folks, we're ending up this day. I'm already in my jammies, showered up. I got a fan going because I'm having a hot flash. I have laundry on my sofa. All kinds of stuff. There it is. I don't know that I told you my weight, did I? I was down 1.2 again today. Did I share that already? Maybe I'm just excited about it. Um, and I want to share a little bit about some of the losses for October 2nd. So finishing up in our group, we lost an entire 25.1 pounds as a group on Team Gina. Give yourselves a hand, you deserve it. 25 pounds in one day is amazing. Just think about that for a second. That's pretty amazing. Our winner of the day was Henry Wolven. And Henry Wolven lost five pounds. Did you hear me right? Yeah, five pounds. <laughs> I almost don't even know what to say to that because that is like unbelievably amazing. So way to go, way to go. And then we had, I'm going to just give you some great, great losses today. I'm, you know, I myself lost 1.2. Angela, my life won, uh, uh, lost one, she won, lost 1.4. Deborah, oh, Deborah, Deb, I'm afraid I'm going to ruin your name. Plungvet, Plungvet. I hope I'm not destroying your name because my actual last name was changed when they came to America, but was von der Berg. <laughs> yeah, it was. And they switched it when they moved to America. But anyways, ooh, off topic. And Juanita lost 0.4. Julie lost 0.2. Um, we have Laura joined us today. Way to go. Thank you for joining us. Uh, Life with Lily lost 2.1 pounds. Yes, you did, Sheila. I'm so proud of you. Yes, I'm kind of talking loud because I got that fan on. I'm not turning it off. I need it. Um, Linda lost 0.5 and Lori lost 1.2 pounds. Yes, she did. Uh, Margaret lost 0.2 and another one joined in. Michelle over at My Everyday Wife Life joined in today. Welcome, Michelle. I'm glad you're with us. Pam, uh, Pam, Pamela Sled lost two pounds. Man, you guys did amazing yesterday. From the day before, it seemed like we had significantly larger losses. Was it that you guys really wanted to play and win? Or, or what do we think caused the amount of losses yesterday? Because it's not like I didn't have your weights from the day before, but we had much, much better losses, and I think that's wonderful. Um, so let's see, uh, P T that's P T T E E, uh, for a while, for most of the day was the winner at 2.6 pounds. Amazing. Amazing. Until Henry came in still in the show. And I'm wondering if Henry's a guy because that would explain it. They just lose faster than we do now, don't they? I don't really think it's a guy, but... Either way, she, she or he had a great day. Um, but that's not taking anything away from PT because, wow, 2.6 in one day is just awesome. And um, 
Okay, I can't read this whole name. Um, oh, Sabrina's. Sabrina, last point, four from Sabrina's Search for Health and Happiness, I think it is. I shortened the H and H. Sorry, Sabrina. Uh, Sonia Campos, last point, eight. Susan Moon, last nine. Stephanie Flores, last 1.4. Man, you guys did great. Uh, Suzanne, last point, two. Suzanne over at Life Begins. And... Uh, Teresa Taylor lost 1.9, just just shy of two pounds in one day. That is amazing, amazing. Okay, so um, Weight Watcher mom on a budget. Yesterday she was our biggest winner at 2.4. Today, do you think she gained? Do you think she stayed the same? Do you think whatever? No, she lost another 1.2. Yes, she did. Man, you guys did great. I'm so proud of every single one of you. So our losses were great, and our total loss for the day, again, was 25.1 pounds. So wonderful. I'm going to be done for the day. Um, I don't really know exactly how Carrie and uh, Sandy are faring today. One, because Carrie is in the middle of a tornado watch or a tornado warning, I'm not sure, but she, if her video don't get up tomorrow at all, we're going to give her some grace because, hello, Mother Nature wins. And um, I haven't had too much time today to go look over a lot at Sandy's channel, so I don't know how they did, but I want you all to know that you did great. Let's keep it up. Let's do it again tomorrow. Talk to you again. Bye-bye. God bless.